peace everyone today is the day before we leave we're going to leave at about 3 or maybe 2 a.m. tomorrow which is like tonight but it's tomorrow um, so we have a lot to do today it is currently 10 30 we tried to get out of the house earlier than that but we took showers and like ate. we have a lot of things to do today we have a lot of people to see and we have more packing to do first stop is clothing drop Salabi. we decided to name our baby big bertha because big black beautiful bertha to be exact <laughs> She is a big lady and she just got a knee replacement yesterday. Couple knee replacements. We took her to get new ball joints mm -hmm. and uh, new disc rotors. So now the wheels and everything is feeling nice and crispy and perfect. Um, yeah, and wait until we do more renovations when we get to Georgia. We're going to show you the ins and outs of the entire van renovation. We're going to show you how to renovate a van. Yeah, we're going to walk you through it because oh, cheap. we know it's going to work out well. We're not even craftsmen or carpenters or nothing like that, you know? We don't got a lot of money. We ain't go get the, the, the sprinter. Yeah, she's not a sprinter van, but look, it's a work, You're it's a passenger work. van. It's a Ford Eco 150. Not even the 250 or the 350, but the 150. Yeah, and it's perfect, it's huge, Which I can't it wait. it just gets better gas mileage, but it's still got the V8 in it, you know? And uh, it's gonna be, a beautiful, big, birthish. Tell me how to spell Bertha, baby. B E R T H A. Oh, that's how you're gonna spell. I thought you were gonna spell it B E A R T H. B E A. No, like Bertha birth. is just Bertha. Like, like Earth. With I mean, like with the word Earth in it. I thought that's, that's what you said. Bertha. Because Earth, Mama Medicine. I don't know. Maybe it's just me who's on to the things. <laughs> Auto parts. Second stop. Advanced Auto Parts. Bertha just got two new windshield wipers and a brand new gallon of or jug of windshield rain repellent fluid. windshield washer fluid. Yep. And we got a cassette tape aux cord connector because there's no there's aux no cord, CD obviously, player. and no CD player. All ready, right. Ready to do this thing? Ready to do this thing. The next time when we stop, okay? When we stop, I'm driving for the rest of the time. <laughs> you want to tell them why I'm driving? Because I don't back down. That's why. That's why. Because he doesn't back down. <laughs> That's the kind of ego freaking bull crap. I'm trying not to say curse words. Nah, man, you can't just, Leads if you're us. driving in traffic, you can't just Too force your way situation. in it. You can't just try to, people waiting in line to get where they're going. We taking our time, everybody taking their time, making sure everybody got their space. And if you try to take advantage and cut everybody off at the end of the line because you in a rush, don't, it's fine. You can do it to whoever you want to do it to. Just don't do it to me. I'm the last person you want to do it to because I'm not going to let you win. That's it. Especially We're letting... Especially Wait. if you don't put your, your signal on, if you don't put your turn signal on, at least we're like, yo, please, like, ask at least. Right, so this guy was rudely trying to skip the entire, I mean, we you see there's, like, crazy traffic going on. Because there's some sort of accident up there or something. This guy's like, I, you know, forget this, I'm gonna, I'm gonna skip the entire thing. And Matt was like, no, you're not. And we almost, I mean, literally one centimeter away from hitting him with our freaking mirror on the sides. And we got metal mirrors, so the mirrors would have fucked his shit up. And that's why I was trying to tell him, like, yo, be easy. First words. Move your shit. Oh, yeah, I'm sorry, YouTube. Sorry, YouTube hall monitors. <laughs> but, you know what I'm saying? His his vehicle would have got damaged. So I'm trying to save him for that. I was just like, yo, move. And he was like, yo, shut the fuck up. Shut the F up, sorry. And so then that escalates it even worse. And it's like, <laughs> you want to get out and fight me? <laughs> Babe, you pay attention now, okay? I'm getting nervous. Um, oh, you want to go fight? You want to fight now? I'm, I'm, I'm gonna kill you now. Mac is very upset and emotions get escalated. And I, I don't get upset. I was just like, man. Listen. I have to, I I'm like, telling him, put the, put the window up. Put the window up. And I'm pulling him out of the freaking window like, because he's yelling with his head sticking out, yelling at them. You know what? This New York, you know, this driving in New York is, is dangerous because everybody's on edge, everybody's angry. 
and then it sucks my baby down into it with them. We're having a great time in the car and he gets all sucked back into that stuff. Who else gets that? You know, where like you have meditated, you have, you know, your day is amazing, and then you get in the car and all of that happy juju is gone. It's happened even before, but you let it get out of hand. I'm still chilling. I'm good. I feel all right. You know what I'm saying? Cause I'm not. I'm day, scared for my life. At the end of the day, he didn't get in front of me. I'm the one in front. You know what I'm saying? Nigga had all. I mean, excuse me. The in the person <laughs> had his fingers all out in the window, and I'm just like, yeah, all right. At the end of the day, you still behind me. B word. M effort. Right. M effort. <laughs> I think it's over. I think this video is already already done. We've already exceeded the curse limit. Yeah, the curse limit. Um, Sorry, YouTube hall monitors. Yeah. <laughs> so yeah, we're on our way to Aunt Joan, all the way in Long Island. It's raining, but our new windshield wipers are beautiful. Beautiful. Peace. We just picked up Aunt Joan, and we are into the bank. Into the bank. What bank we going to, Auntie? T. Uh, Leopold. T. D. Bank. T. D. Bank. T. D. Bank. All right, that's all right. where we're going. You want to see a show? <laughs> I just dropped my aunt off back at the rehab. That brings our visit to a conclusion. And it's approximately 2.45, so we're, 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 still, we're, on, we're still on okay time. A little bit behind. We're gonna be tired when we have to pack up everything, because I bet you we're gonna pack up everything and we're gonna have, we're gonna have like two Passed seconds down. to sleep, and then leave. I'm gonna have the itis, because I'm starving. Oh yeah, we're hungry, so we should probably plan for that in a second. Yeah. Okay. So bank, food, junkyard. Yeah! Bank, food, junkyard? Bank, food, junkyard! Bank, food, junkyard! That's just a wrap, right? You can just click them. Nice. Yay! Got it, That's Uno. Thank you, man. There goes the last seat. That's it. C'est la vie. Goodbye, seats. That's it. C'est la vie. All right. Termina. Thank you, Able Auto Salvage in Long Island. If you need anything done, as far as auto salvage goes, tell them Matt and V sent you. Go there. All right. Beautiful. We're back. We are back and uh, we saw my friend Greg in Brooklyn. We dropped off the seats, you saw that. And um, now we see those boxes we just got from Staples. It's time to pack. Are you gonna help? Romy, you gonna help? No, he's not gonna help. Here we go and we're off. Goodbye, 250 McLean. Goodbye, apartment. There it goes, goodbye, right behind Yonkers. us. Rumi, say goodbye. And it is approximately... 2.28. It's 2.30 in the morning, and we're off. Goodbye, Yonkers. It's been a cool 20 years. <laughs> Good riddance. Oh, it smells like fart in Delaware. <laughs> Thank you, sir. Thank you. you too. We're, We're on in the Delaware. Way. Delaware. Where you're underwear in Delaware. Yeah, watch on out your for this hill. truck, babe. I see the truck. The truck better watch out for me. We are in Delaware and we are on our way. 95 South. 95 South. We're on 95 South. It's approximately 5.13 a.m. We have not slept at all since 8 a.m. Yeah. So we are almost at 24 hours of no sleep yeah, and lots of work. Team no sleep. Yeah. Like we have been non-stop, not yeah. even sleep, just non-sleep. Delirious. And he's delirious now. It's, it's like <laughs> I don't know what's happening, but it's like it's causing more fuel. <laughs> I'm running off adrenaline, baby. That's all it is. Pure wheel of fire. It's 
5.41. We're exhausted. So the fog rolled up out of nowhere. Yeah, it's so incredibly foggy out there. Like, I had a freak out moment. And it's so hard to see that I think we're going to... We're going to park up for a little while. Park at this up. rest stop. and my maybe... eyes are getting fucking heavy. And it looks like a goddamn horror movie out here. Yeah, I think we're going to take like um, a little nap. Like an hour or two. And then get back on the road when the sun's up. You can see it's something. safer because we're both just like... We're tired. <laughs> Alright. Peace. Later. So uh, it's like 7 a.m. and we're at the rest stop and um, I'm going to use the restroom and get in the driver's seat and get us going. Exhausted. Hey everyone, we are in Virginia. We just stopped at this Taco Bell to get some sun for and walk around for a second. Let Rumi get in the grass. What's up? Rumi's leash is buried in all of our stuff on accident. I forgot to pack it in like the accessible stuff, so he has a ribbon tied around his neck. Oh gosh. <laughs> no pavement. Almost in North Carolina, we're so close to the border, and this happens. So now we are changing the tire. They told us that they do not carry the type of tires that our van has, they only carry commercial tires, and they only work on trucks. So now we're gonna ask them, Matt's gonna ask them if they can at least help us take off our spare tire because that's like our main problem is it's like sort of rusted on and we can't unbolt it. Alrighty. So the universe always provides because what are the odds that right next to the gas station that we broke down at, well, the, we got the hole in the tire and then we pulled over at the nearest gas station. Oh, we can swing it around to the right. Um, oh, to the left? All right, then. Thank Thanks, you. Um, right next to the gas station, there's a place called Red Wines Tire Service. There it is. Um, here in Virginia, we're really close to the border of North Carolina. And these guys are awesome. So, what is but they, life only, the struggle, they only work on commercial trucks. So they couldn't help us. They couldn't help us and give us a new tire. But they were nice enough to put the spare on for us. Um, since our spare was like rusted to our tr our van, we couldn't get it out ourselves. We needed like some expert tools. And they did that for us. And now we're gonna go to Firestarter to get a brand new tire. Um, but what that is life just goes to the exactly, man. Hey, our initiation into van life on the yeah, first day. <laughs> first trip. First. First trip, but you know what? Now we know we're gonna have we're gonna get new tires before we do this trip. We're gonna make sure that all the rest of the tires are new once we get to Georgia, and we're gonna have tire fix some tools yeah. so that next time if this yeah. were to ever happen, we know what to do. I mean, we knew we knew what to do. It's just that we just didn't have what we needed. So 
But Thank you know God what? There's so good people in the world too, man. The universe took care of us. Word. The universe took care of us. So. Good people in the world. Yesterday, baby almost lost a phone. Good yeah, phone yesterday I lost my phone when we were oh, in Brooklyn, second. and we went back, and someone had turned it into the coffee shop that we were in. So. Um, you know, we're just, we're, we are protected. We are protected. So if you keep affirming that, it will work because I affirm that every single day, like a million times a day, that I am protected, I am safe, and the universe will provide for me. So, all right, on to Firestarter. We are significantly behind time now. We're probably going to get to Georgia around like midnight now, if not later. But we're keeping our spirits high. Because it's dark. Is that going to die? What's the, what's, <laughs> <laughs> what's the diagnosis? Is it starvation till death? Because we have the snack bag and it's full of stuff. I thought it was one of these. Never put a cat treat bag <laughs> in the same box as your gold rub. That's treat. hilarious. He's like, babe, turn the light on. Oh my gosh. <laughs> and then we look at it and it's cat treats. And so it is. And so we are here. It's about 2 p.m. Matt and I just woke up an hour ago. <clears throat> we still have yet to like take showers and recover from that 24 hour trip down sun here. Sun showers! <laughs> yeah, he's taking a sun shower. Be naked. <laughs> it's so beautiful out here in my parents' house. Um, Big Birth is over there waiting on us to unload her with all of our crap and Today's gonna be the first day of the van build. We're just gonna do the basics, I think, which is like removing the paneling and probably getting starting on getting started on insulation. So um, when Dad gets back, he's gonna. Well, we're gonna like take showers and get ourselves together, and then put up, come up, come up with our list and um, go forward with the day. So here's Georgia. Check it out. There she is. 